My name is Lesson, 27 years, born and raised in a small fishing village, South Morocco, North Africa. The village is mostly known for fishing. It was also the land for the hippie surfers late 70s. The longest wave in North Africa. Empty spots, fresh fish, summer all year long. That was way before. Now it's a surf destination to everyone. A magical fishing village called home by so many surfers all around the globe. Son of a fisherman, at four years old, my father and older brothers used to take me with them to him Swan Center, the harbor where the wave is. I kept playing by the beach all day long, and that's where it all started. Body surfing was my first interaction with the wave. Following I jumped to bodyboarding, my other brother offered me a bodyboard when I graduated second year of primary school. I used to watch Talah, my friend, first local longboarder. He saw me how motivated I was and pushed me to keep on surfing. I was really impressed by his skills and he inspired me to ride traditional surfboards. He was the one who crossed his path with many great surfers before me and shared his knowledge which kept me curious and craving for more learning and practice. I remember my first nose ride, it felt so good. The only idea I had in my mind, I'm never letting it go, the sensation should remain. My relation with the ocean has grown through years. All what was in my child's mind and heart is running to the beach and witness the reflection of the warm orange sunset on the surface of the water. I feel for the ocean. All I needed as a groom is to stay by the sea, be in touch and have a story with it and that hasn't changed to our present moment. Hello, what's your name again? I think I know you well From a dream I had Yesterday night Why, tell me why Oh, 
Funny story. My friends used to call me Masita, meaning the hammer in Arabic. There wasn't a time where I went surfing and I didn't go out without a ding on my surfboard. Just a dream I had From yesterday night